Hey, the presidential race, it's going to be the biggest focus on Election Day in November, of course. But, you know, there will be some key races as well. Happening here in Minnesota, our chief political reporter Tom Hauser is here now. And Tom, you have exclusive new KSTP Survey USA poll results in the U.S. Senate race and the race for control of the Minnesota House. Yeah, Leah, a lot of Minnesotans have not yet focused on the fact Minnesota will have a U.S. Senate election. Amy Klobuchar running to attempt to be Minnesota's first four-time U.S. Senator. And Republicans are trying to win back control of the Minnesota House. Thank you. Democratic U.S. Senator Amy Klobuchar might be the most popular politician in Minnesota history, at least according to margins of victory in three previous Senate races. She's won by margins ranging from 20 to 34 percentage points since 2006. According to our first KSTP Survey USA poll of the 2024 race against Republican Joe Frazier, she has a 16 point lead, 49% to 33. But there's a big number of undecided voters, 14%. 9% prefer another candidate. Joe Frazier's name ID is probably in the teens at best, right? He just got started a few weeks ago, and he's already at 33% in your poll. So that shows that there's a good, solid block of Republican voters for him to start with. But the trick is, how do you get past that 50% plus one? And as we know, no Republican has won statewide in Minnesota since my old boss, Tim Pawlenty, back in 2006. I think that once uh, uh, the, the campaign starts, uh, Amy's going to have a huge, huge war chest, as well as the state party is, is really uh, well positioned to help her. The House will come to order. Then there's the battle for control of the Minnesota House, where Republicans need to pick up four seats to win a majority. According to Survey USA, Democrats have a five-point lead over Republicans, with 11 percent undecided. DFL candidates have a 34-point lead in urban areas and a smaller 8-point lead in suburbs. Republicans have a 25-point lead in rural areas. There are two rural Democrats in the House right now, and I think they could be in danger. There's an open seat in Winona, so I think Republicans do see a path to winning the state House back. Yeah, I think that uh, the same problem that uh, Republicans are going to have, is, that Joe Frazier is going to have, is that they don't have the war chest that the Democrats have. I think the Speaker is super focused on not only saving the seats that she has, but to grow. And you can see more analysis of all of our poll results on At Issue Sunday morning at 10. And review all of our results from SurveyUSA at KSTP.com. Leah. Tom Hauser reporting.